Pogam, Piacenza Oil and Gas Museum, The History of Black Gold in the Context of Magic Science and Technology. Ignite the gas stove, strike a match, or turn a lighter to see a regular blushing flame. These gestures have become so usual that they do not stimulate questions or set wondering anymore. However, behind these flames there is ancient and recent history, magic and scientific of petroleum once known as rock oil. The Piacenza Oil and Gas Museum makes a fundamental contribution to the understanding of the formation of hydrocarbons in the bowels of the Earth. From their centuries-old use as a source of energy and as a medicinal use, the development of techniques that characterize the oil production cycle from the point of extraction to the refining. In Italy, the knowledge and the use of oil dates back to the ancient period. Already in the 37 books of the natural history as of the 1st century AD, Anno Domini after Christ, there are references to Piacenza oil called rock oil. The author, Plinio, happened to pass across the locality of Bilea, present Piacenza, and was impressed by the events regarding the natural gas existence reported in the terms as the clash of mountains, noise, flames and smoke. The dawn of the homemade oil used in Piacenza can be referred to 1600 in Monte Chiaro, present River Garo, to Earl's family Morando, father and the son, which since 1590 have developed prosperous oil marketing activities, still called rock oil. Unequivocal evidences have left the naturalist Paolo Boccone, which one in 1684 testified. The countryman cook sings to the heat of these flames the pancakes from chestnut flour and in the same way they also cook meat in the pots. And also Alessandro Volta, Italian physicist best known for the intervention of the battery. In 1805 the geographer Captain Antonio Boccia when arrived in the locality of Velia, has noted. Going down in Cero, three quarters of a mile long way from the church to the north, you can see an area that burns until it stops. And when it stops, it won't not flame up again, till you do not apply again the flame. In 1893, Ludovico Marazzani activated industrial method of oil exploration in the village of Montechino, Velea and Graparello. The grant obtained from the state was later transferred to the French company Petroles de Montechino. The late 19th and early 20th century, an important contribution to the nascent coming up oil industry gave Luigi Scotti, citizen of Piacenza. He happened to be in Antoia of Padenzano, where Scotti accomplished a significant, for the time, drilling and mining. The memorist Galati in the early 20th century stated Today the oil industry is limited. It can be said, as it is used to be said in Piacenza, it is not appropriate to take into account certain facts of research efforts in other regions or that ones that succeeded almost fruitless because of the attempts that were carried out empirically without the necessary doctrine and without knowledge of those processes and the use of those means that modern science has for similar industries. In the first decades of the 20th century, Podenzano baptized the yards of Egypt, Azienda Generale Italiano Petroli, General Italian Oil Company, that is an Italian public oil company founded in 1926, with well, each time more and more deeper, 90 meters, 120 meters, 300 meters, 450, 800, 1200, and finally 1400 meters. In the 30s, the production of oil in Piacenza was amounted to over than 60% of the national one. Post-war period, the researches led to the deposit discovery of Corte Maggiore 
and Caviaga in the province of Lodi that with the guidance of Enrico Mattei and Carlo Zanmatti were like the springboard for the nation of Italian oil industry. Piacenza Oil and Gas Museum is divided in two different sections. The first one is located inside Museo Civico di Storia Naturale and the second one inside Piacenza Campus of the Politecnico di Milano. The visit starts from the ample and articulated collection of stones and minerals collected with the appointment and passion of Giovanni Dosi, 1912-2006. The museum boasts itself an amazing collection of 1,103 samples coming from 56 different countries. Italy provided the largest quantity of samples, around 300 are coming from almost all regions. The valuable collection consists of a great variety and quantity of beautiful findings. At Pogam you can find and admire 365 different species belonging to 146 mineralogical places. Professionals, experts and also passionate people about the oil and gas sector gave their support to realize the thematic section devoted to the region and formation of oil. The itinerary starts with the Raimondo del Prete collection 1850-1937, which offers a large overview of malacology and conchology formations and introduces to the mineralizations responsible for the origin of the hydrocarbons in the underground. Some taglines show the far past transformation process that millions of years ago changed into oil or gas unlimited calves of microorganisms that and then gradually sunk into the dirt. We can also see some findings and core drills of oil industry, drawings of wells, sections with pictures and texts, far styling, the critical events and the main characters of Piacenza and Italy oil history. The next pavilion shows the history of the oil knowledges of 15th and 18th century when many spontaneous outcrops occurred especially in the Penin area and the oil collection to be used for domestic and pharmaceutical needs began. A prosperous documentation with scale mini models but also equipment used for oil researchers witnesses the homemade phase between 15th and 18th century and the illustrative methods evolution between the end of the 19th and 20th century. The museum review reminds the effort and the intelligence of the pioneers who firstly recovered the oil naturally emerged using rudimentary tools, secondly they built collector wells equipped with wooden structure and brickworks. The drilling system using rigs and mechanical advanced methods began in 1859 Thanks to the increased demand of oil due to the invention of the combustion engine and cars at the end of the 19th century. During the itinerary mansion is made of pioneers of oil industry with a gallery of past tagelines, videos, technical drawings, advertising pictures. This useful documentation helps to better understand the relevance of hydrocarbons in the world as well as the reputation of Italian industries such as Eni, Edison, Drillmec and other associated companies. The shown documents include the list of the people who were awarded of title of Egypt Pioneer in Milan in 1986. The virtual tour in the oil history goes on with a dedicated section in the industrial archaeology, rigs, drilling pipes, valves and mechanical equipment that during the 1900s characterized the drilling industry with its legendary character that drillman.
a bit explorer and a bit dozer, a scientist with a whole reserve in his mind. Today, research is driven by mathematicians, physicists, chemists, geologists. They give directions in the simulator rooms to identify the reservoir in faraway places. They saw in millimetric slices the stone core. They can scan them, stack data and uh, decide where to drill and when to stop. The big murals painted by a group of Piacenza high school students suggest an afterwards story from the one described in the Piacenza Oil and Gas Museum tour. But there is a close synergy between the representation and the museum. The sharing of opinions between Pogam, the Politecnico Universitario, the Comune di Piacenza and the leader companies in this field led to the launch of a professional Pogam Excellence School characterized by a strong dedication to the work. A school for high-skilled people, it is specialized in the technical preparation in addition to the school education, with training programs aimed at the young graduated students, manager and oil gas experts. Master suitable to meet all the job necessities, also where business sectors are not compatible each other. Joined by the need to have people moved all together, anyone having its own vital roles and tasks. Pogam Museum and Pogam Excellence School are like a tandem for the future. <laughs> 